Hey guys, today we're going to be watching Across the Spider-Verse. And if you want us to check out other superhero stuff, comment it down below. If you guys want to see the full recording of this video, then head over to patreon.com slash in the milk and go we'll get a bunch of bonus stuff with that. Subscribe! Let's do things differently this time. Like, so differently. This movie is so good because, like, it's a testament to, like, how if there's, like, good music, the movie is good. <laughs> yeah, good that's thing. it. That's it, bro. Well, like, this opening monologue is, like, so much more entertaining because the music is synced with it perfectly. But they didn't really know me. And I didn't really know him either. If you literally freeze frame, you could see that Peter was literally wearing the dinosaur costume. Wait, because he's going to be the lizard. Eden's really good with these fun facts, man. I just like paying attention to movies. It's not that I saw one fun <laughs> fact on Twitter and now I know that. I am excited for the comment section where half of it is just going to be random fun facts that I've already seen on Twitter 20 times. I love how chill the music is. It's so good. It's such a great Killing contrast. My Killing friend. my Killing friend. Killing my yeah. friend. Did you see the trans flag on the police jacket? Did you see the trans girl in front of us? Did you see the trans wristwatch? The trans dishes? The trans dishes? Are you kidding? <laughs> I'll eat up a trans meal, bro. God damn. I, I got a job to do, Gwen. It won't bring him back. Do the shot, bro. Oh my god. Because it shows like how divided they are. Like he's in the blue, she's in the purple, and like they're so like not together right now. She's got green hair like a lime because limes are sour. We've, we're making so many jokes about this movie, but I just remember the first time I watched this movie, I was in tears <laughs> at, at how beautiful it was. No, I was blown away. All the Gwen world stuff, like the aesthetic is yeah. impeccable. The way the color palette constantly shifts is something that makes me think of comic books, especially like indie comics, but it's not something I see in animation very often. I love her theme, bro. It's so good. Oh, this scene's so good. Shout out Spencer Ron, man. Spencer Ron? He worked on a lot of, like, visual development. But he also animated some of the best-looking cuts in Owl House. Ooh. But why does he have two first names? I can't trust him now. Everybody on my signal! Look out for signs of Spider-Woman! You know, I just realized it makes sense. He called her Spider-Woman, I was like, that's weird. She's Spider-Gwen. And I'm like, no, they wouldn't be calling Spider <laughs> first name. <laughs> Hardest fucking frame ever. Hardest frame. Let the cape down, bro. Let the cape up. I want to see the ass. I don't care about the cape. Oh! Oh! Miguel O'Hare. I lead an elite strike force dedicated to the security of the multiverse. Actually, it. Isn't it funny <laughs> how, like, the two villains of the movie, they try to explain their backstory, but both Miles and Gwen tried to skip over No, them. the ADHD protagonist is a growing epidemic in our society, okay? <laughs> Are you, uh, oh, this? Wait, why is she pregnant? Someone kill that baby right now! Kill that baby! She'll do it herself, bro. He'll disrupt the planet. Miguel is just like a friend in like middle school. You guys are playing pretend and he's like, that's not canning to the story. What are you doing? Is Miguel like the really adamant anti-shipper on Twitter? He's like, you cannot ship these characters with each other. He's the overly serious friend playing D&D. &D. It's so beautiful. Oh. It's uh, it's like a moving painting, which is something people say too much, but it's true. Well, join the club. It's like not really fair that she gets to have a living parent when like Peter doesn't have any. Peter Parker. Peter Parker's family was fried up. <laughs> God damn. Is, is that the backstory for Spider Ham? Just get. Uh, uh. Give me your money. <laughs> I love Spot. He's such a good villain. He's such a dork. It's such a fun power, too. Like, they use it in so many cool ways. <laughs> yeah, it's so creative. I hear that new Spider-Man is Puerto Rican. <laughs> nah, he, he seems more Dominican to me. Dude, when I watched this movie in Latin America, I felt so embarrassed when none of the Hispanic American jokes landed with the audience there. I'm just like, oh, God, they hate us. I'm white. There's a bad guy on the roof of the Peterson building. Can you call the police? All of his roommates oh. playing the fucking Spider-Man game on the <laughs> Oh, yeah. That shit's running at like 12 FPS. That's what the way Funds was streaming it the other day. He's got it on 5 <laughs> FPS on his stream. I, I gotta get back to being a great student, so can we make this quick? <laughs> <laughs> Body language is so good. Immigrant family. I'm from Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico is part of America. I really like that joke where it's like Puerto Rico is part of America. It's a joke. It's just a joke. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a really long prank America's been running. You thought I could do something special. And now I think so too. I think I'm special. I'm neurodivergent. I'm autistic. What? How is 
is autistic? Did I hear that right? He did not say that. I'm no. on the spectrum. No. That's your story. You're autistic. That's your story. <laughs> we got you in the Princeton. There you go, buddy. That guy, he's barely a villain of the week. What'd you call me? Bro. Uh, such a hater. Dude, the small things you could say have great consequences, Miles. I ran a test on this collider that brought a spider here from another dimension. 2D animation in a movie in theaters that's not from Japan? You hit me with a bagel. You hit me with a bagel. No! I'll make you respect me! Ow! <laughs> he fucking defeats himself. Oh, your son. How's he doing? This is something amazing. This is what all sons should do. Put on a mask and, <laughs> and give therapy to your father. Chat, put on the dream mask and give your dad some therapy. Oh Yo. my god, it's the 14 year old bro. The goat. There's a 14 year old goat? Bad. Yeah, the 14 year old goat animated the entire Lego scene, bro. For you, it's just a Tuesday night. You're acting like weird stuff like this happens to you all the time. Jack, do you know what this is from? No. She's from Venom. Venom. She's from Venom? Is she actually? She is. I saw Venom 2 into the car, raise the carnage or whatever liar. it's called. And <laughs> You're a liar. I'm not lying. What the fuck? That makes me sad because that was a funny joke in the movie. And now that I know it's connected to Venom, it makes me very angry. Oh, no. Tomorrow morning, Spider-Man, page one with a decent picture this time. You're absolutely right, boss. I'm so Shut up. It's like so distinctly <laughs> animated from the other Lego movies, too, because it just feels like a YouTube animation made by a kid. Well, a lot better than something made by a kid. Kid. Yeah, but this was made by a kid a 14 year old goat in fact <laughs> Oh, no, okay, 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 oh okay, bro. He said that like he's about to go into a rap. Okay, 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 okay You live in my dream <laughs> And everything changed for the better. That's the creepy guy. Did you see him? There he is. Look at him. Look at him Why is he what so guy? weird? What guy? The guy in that last scene, he just stares at Spider-Man. He doesn't blink. <laughs> Everybody is like theorizing that he's going to be like a villain in the next movie or something. It's my life. It's not your life. It's mine. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, they're giving him such shit. I love it. Well, he doesn't even try and like make up an excuse. He just doesn't say anything. All right, great. Walk away. Hold on, the best song in that movie is about Playboy. Oh, Hummingbird, bro. Oh, such a good song, bro. Metro Boom and Make It Boom. He boomed all over the soundtrack. White woman jump scare. White woman jump scare. Oh my God, Jesus Christ. Is Spider-Man grounded? Uh, let me check real quick. Um, what's going on down there? Um, nothing. <laughs> The amazing part about this movie is that they understand that you need to have random segments in your movie that is just Spider-Man doing cool shit because that is the benefit of making a Spider-Man movie. Yeah, they make every exposition scene like entertaining in its own way. Yeah, just the character is constantly on the move. Where did she go? Dude, she left him on red, man. That's kind of fucked up. They call me Spider Ghost because I love ghosting men. In every universe, I will ghost your bitch. <laughs> In every other universe, Gwen Stacy falls for Spider Man. Stop. Don't say the line. Don't say the line. Stop! I can't even take, I can't even take the line. <laughs> End well. Play play the clip. Play the clip. It doesn't end well. Play the clip, man. <laughs> I don't want to see this Gwen die because I care about this one. <laughs> There's a first time for everything. Yeah, there is a first time for everything because this is the first time a Gwen has been an entertaining character. The first time Gwen dies and we actually care. Miles. All right. It's uh, it's really Jeez. delicate. Oh, you think black people can't be delicate now, huh, Gwen? Okay. <laughs> they need to insert me into that scene so I can, like, wokeify Gwen. She's not woke enough. Hello! Hello. And then Pizza Jack comes up. Like, Hello! I'm Pizza Jack. Shoot, I have to go. Really? Yeah, I, uh, I, I forgot to get my steps in. <laughs> 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 Wherever you go from here, you have to promise to take care of that little boy for me. I love his parents. I just like that it's like a superhero story that is very centered around their relationship with their parents on both sides. Yeah. A lot of times they skip over it because it's annoying to deal with, but they decide to tackle that in a really good way. Very grounded. Well, they're kind of high up right now. <laughs> I'll see you later. With a cake. He brings Miguel over. <laughs> I'll make you pay for 
everything you took away from me. Just having an arc of the villain gradually becoming more threatening is so entertaining to watch. Because usually it's like an insane villain that they can't beat and they have to grow in power. But now it's like the villain and the hero growing to meet each other. This is gonna make me paranoid that a light skin is like upside down in my room somewhere <laughs> just watching you. Like I think there's one behind me, right? Ah! I think you have that power core. I think you can embrace your inner light skin. Is that why no one talks to me at parties? Oh, I love this fucking place. It's, it's oh, I love this. The place. design is so fucking good. The design is good, but let's not act like this wouldn't be the most terrible place to live on in the fucking planet. Like, I would... are you shitting on India? What do you got quick, against bro? India, man? What do you got against India? I'm not talking about India. I'm talking about this fictional this moon bat in place. No, it is not. It's this is a real place. What are you talking about? I'm in the zone. Got... That was almost a repeat scene of the fucking. Oh my god, dude! Every universe, man. Best guy! Yes. Best guy! I love Spider-Man India, bro. Chai tea, chai means tea, bro. Dude, he's spilling. Yeah, he's, he's spilling, spilling his chai, chai tea everywhere. Chai tea, bro. God damn. This is where the traffic is. This is where the traffic is. This is also where the traffic is. There's traffic here too. And this is where the British stole all of our stuff. Whoa. That's kind of <laughs> weird to imply because it they're in India. And that's where the British stole their stuff in India? Well, maybe the British stole their stuff and then they just moved the entire building <laughs> back to India. They should have had it. This is where we stole all of Britain stuff. They'd steal like a one can of beans <laughs> and some dirt. The, the Queen of England is just in the museum in like a glass can. Let me out! <laughs> Let me out! Yo! Okay, yes. man. Only good British person. Yes, Hobie! I need toothbrush. Wait, what? Where's my chucks? <laughs> spider cuck, spider cuck. That's one of the canon events that they didn't go over in this movie is getting cucked. It's one of the core parts of being Spider-Man. <laughs> Miguel was just cucked so hard in his universe. That's why he was so angry. Yeah, he, the, the whole daughter thing is a big distraction. He really just got cucked. Um, your dad's gonna die, loser. What was that? Our future. Dude, so the effects cool, animation. So cool. Oh, ah, this spot looks so cool. It makes me soy jack. Mob cycle. No, this looks more like an Eve. I hate scenes like this because it wants to imply that like they saved everybody. Look at what is happening on the one person. Now they has saved to everybody. Died. They're the spider people. Fuck you. They never lose. Fuck no you. one died. I, I just feel like one person had to have died Shut in this up. situation. And maybe that person deserved to die. You have to choose girlfriend or old man. We all know what he would choose, bro. We all know what he would choose. Also, I think there's more people in the bus, yeah. right? It's not just his girlfriend. So he's objectively saving more people if he saves the bus. I got him, I got him. Miles! Gwen's fucked for this, man. I promised. She walks over and fucking breaks his neck, kills him on the spot. What happened to that small elite strike team? A lot of these are part time. Reference, ref oh my God, robot Spider-Man. Guy Spider-Man. Thicker Spider-Man. Twerking Spider-Man. Coated in oil Spider-Man. Video game guy. I love video games. Another video game guy. You, are you talking to me? Oh, so many just different stuff happening here. Sorry. VTuber Spider-Man. I do not fuck with VTuber Spider-Man. She does help out Miles later in the film, but like VTuber Spider-Man is a little much for me. Did she actually help him though? The answer to that is kind of ambiguous. They don't really answer that directly. It could be inferred, but you can't really be sure. It's a text whatever dimension your DNA is from and sends you there. That look, that looks like an Angry Birds character. It looks like one of the, the fucking pigs. Bet this doesn't even do anything. Maybe it did before you ripped it out of a wall. Hobie is creating the band for Gwen that she uses later in the movie in the background of the scene, bro. This was so serious the first time I saw it, and this just became the biggest fucking meme on the planet, bro. <laughs> Humbling reality, Spider-Man has arrived. Miles! Dude. Oh, there he is, the goat! The finger sucker. Oh my god, he's my favorite Spider-Man. Get those fingies out, bro. Get them sucking. Hey, you want to see pictures? I mean, she's right there. Oh, look at his pig. Do you think this pisses Miguel off because his daughter's dead? Specifically, like yes. I have a daughter I love so much. Isn't that awesome, Miguel? The arachno-humanoid poly multiverse. Which sounds stupid too, I guess. 
<laughs> I guess. I like that he's like so threatening, but they still make his dialogue funny and have like personality to it. Well, it's because yeah. he's gonna end up being a good guy halfway through the next movie. He's not all bad, you know what I mean? Well, he's all bad. Have Damn you seen that dumper? Boy, he's Captain Stacy. That's Spectacular Spider. Is that Spectacular Spider Man? No. Spectacular Spider Man's later. I yeah. think that's him. Oh my god, it's Andrew Garfield! I don't, I don't like this scene because they want, they're trying to make it look like the Amazing Spider-Man movies are good. That pisses me off specifically because those movies fucking suck. I thought it was harmless. <laughs> he has a bow on his head. <laughs> 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 that oh that my cut god. is still funny. Vine boom and like, I don't even know. Isn't that right, Peter? I'm excited to see more of this backstory in the next movie, like Peter's involvement too, because he was there. The next movie's gonna open. He's just destroying a burger, fingers in mouth. <laughs> My name's Peter B. Parker, and for the past 27 years, I've been Spider-Man. For the past 27 years, I've been eating this one burger. And all the good we did, it, it wouldn't have been done. It's just spectacular Spider-Man! Spider-Man! Spider 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 No. <laughs> this is the first anime. The, the funniest moment anime. in the whole movie. We know it's hard. Yo! But it's the truth, Miles. Hey, fuck you. Liz deserved better. Fuck you. Liz Kill yourself. Liz deserved better. Why is he so manlit? He's like three feet tall. Yeah, I hope he helped him escape. Yes! Oh, I love him. Yeah, I did not realize how like deeply involved Hobie is in his running away. Stop Spider-Man. Let me let me the Spider Verse Burger. I love the implication of this because it's like you're Spider Man and you discover this network of other Spider people, and then Miguel is like, you're flipping patties for the next nine years. My bad, everybody. There was somewhere to run. Oh my god, it's Metro Boomin Spider Man. That's so cool. I didn't know that. Dude, this movie, when I saw it the third time on an edible, this scene in particular was so scary to me. Like, I, <laughs> like, I was being chased by a million Spider-Men. And you are. There's spiders in your walls right now, Jack. <laughs> You're the reason I had her, okay? And I named my baby daughter Miles because of you. <laughs> a weird name for, for a girl, but, you know, we're making it work. And you Listen. are so bad at holding a baby. We got your location. <laughs> He's holding it like, they're gonna fly in the sky, dude. Ooh, maybe Miles is gonna prove himself. He's gonna deliver the pregnant woman's baby in Beyond the Spider. -Man, <laughs> because that was beyond his expectations. Or maybe Spot does it. Spot opens a hole and they don't have to do like a seat. <laughs> he did just beat you, so I'm not a terrible mentor. You're both equally terrible. Oh, dude, this, this set piece is amazing. Stop pretending you know where you're going. Oh, I have a plan. Oh, yeah, he has a plan. My name is Miles Morales. Is. It's Miles Morales. Morales! And he's Spider-Man, bitch! The spider that gave you your powers wasn't from your dimension! What the- This is like the whistling theme again. The awkward whistling theme that was in like the comedy scenes. Miguel, go easy on him! You don't belong here. You never did. I want to be in Miles' position right here. I want him to tell me I'm worthless. You knew? Ain't trust the white, bro. Never trust the white. Why would you say that? <laughs> nah. I'm gonna do my own thing. Nah. nah. I'm gonna do my own thing. Hell yeah, bro. Nah. And he starts busting it down on the dance floor. I'm gonna do my own thing. Starts twerking on the train. I taught him how to do that, so I gotta be a pretty good mentor. Pull that off. <laughs> <laughs> I taught him how to swing in 24 frames a second. Dimensional signature identified. He doesn't notice. He's in a rush. <laughs> yeah, I didn't notice this at first either. Oh my lord. Look, okay, so this is what I was trying to show you. See. Oh I was trying my to show god, you the oh god. See. Look, the VTuber in the scene, she yeah, has she the off. She not to. But no, it's because she knows he's going to the wrong dimension. Okay? No, that's not why. She doesn't see it. Look, man, it could be for multiple reasons, okay? Eden just doesn't want to believe that a VTuber is a good person. All he had to do was listen. 
Why didn't he listen? Oh my god, back those muscles, back muscles, man. I think he could choke me to death with his deltoids alone, bro. What the hell? They really got full mileage out of that PG rating. They said ass, damn, and hell in this movie. Fuck, dude, it looks so good. Her fucking universe looks so good, bro. I want to live in Gwen's universe. I'd be like so fluid. I'd be like gender fluid if I was there. Because like, all the colors are so fluid. <laughs> just, would you just... You wouldn't even look at me. Bro, he looks like he's been eating TV dinners for like the past three months. Man. Like, he does <laughs> not look good right now. Gwen was cooking in this household. I can't. Why not? Because I quit. Whoa. Notice how when things are good, the room turns white because white is the color of good. Mm -hmm. True. Oh, babe, I go. Am, am, I, am I too late? What did you do to your hair? Are you guys okay? Tell me you're okay. She a baddie, but her eye color is different. Oh my God, her, wait. No, her eye color is the same. What are you talking about? Her eye color is different, bro. I'm trans. <gasps> That's, That's so such hard. a good shot, man. A little. How much trouble can you have to take, right? A lot of trouble. Yeah. This scene is like the dumbest scene in the entire movie right here. She's like, your son is missing and there's nothing I could do about it. Um, bye. <laughs> and she just makes them like worry yeah. what the fuck is happening. And she accomplishes absolutely nothing. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's the only scene where I'm like, why? Rest, Rest in, in power. power. Oh! Window was open, so I came in because that's normal to do. Why are you here <laughs> right now? You you serve no purpose. You should kill yourself now. Really? That's the most evil part about this is that they strip untied my boys' jays. They creased them. I know you don't want to be the problem. Whoa, that shot is so sick, man. I'm not. I kissed a boy, and his name was Miles Morales. Dun, dun. He is my nephew, and it's really weird. So I'm gonna stop making this joke. That was a good one, man. That was a really good one. I'm really happy about that one. <laughs> <laughs> Who is he? I don't know. Who is he? I'm Miles Morales. Oh, that's who he is. All right, see you next year. See you next year, everybody. Next, are you sure it's next year? Maybe, maybe. Pay the fucking actors, you piece of shit. Pay your damn writers. I need Spider-Verse. Pay your fucking people, kid. Stop being so fucking greedy for three seconds. Pay them. I'm greedy. I want to watch Spider-Verse too. I could do without the VTuber in this spot. Yeah, I don't really like her. Like, you're a weirdo. You're not supposed to be here right now. Yeah, everybody else is very normal. It just doesn't fit. Kid Named Finger. Oh no, my god, world. is that the start? Hi, I'm Kid Named Finger, and I'm this universe's one and only finger. All right, if you guys want us to watch more spider whenever spider comes out, to get this video to a spider like. Shout out to our spiders. Shout out to our spiders. Alejandro Paredes, Asmus Biogar, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kamlu, Communism is One People's iPhone, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, James, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granados, Gub, Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow, Jonathan, Helio, I Love Spilling the Milk, Isaiah Alfred, Kamui, Night VDB, Lilac Moon, My Artistry, Master Nate, Misty Skies, Nate, of Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Puffles, Remuel, and Steven Sanchez, Terrence Sills, Useless Grunt, Val Explicit, Wyatt Lime, Yahir Sanchez.